Welcome to the Swerte del Molino farm in Arrocha Valley, Huelva province, state of Andalusia, in Spain. Here we are a part of nature and not apart from nature. It is difficult, but we enjoy it. On the northwestern border with the neighbor closest to the house, tiny swales. Here I have planted a Siberian elm, Siberian elm tree. It actually grew well in spite of the horror summer we had and no, win no winter rain. So I will say this is a success. On the second swale, northwest, just below the house, I also have planted a tree just to see what comes from it. The Scots, Scots pine. It grew perhaps two centimeters, but it's still alive. Scots pine. Rosemary is alive. The Parlovnia is complaining it would like to have some water. And uh, the corn is growing or has grown. I don't think there's any seed because it was too far from pollination from another one. Parlovnia is also complaining. This is the first morning I had a sweater on since March. Overcast and some rain forecasted. But uh, I will sing when it happens. On the third swale, northwest. All the uh, corn was eaten by the deer. They ate some of the pumpkin as well, but it grew back. Here I have planted the Portugal pine, the Southern Atlantic European pine. When one drives to the Algarve for the holiday, you see these pines all over the place. It grew about 10 centimeters. Not too bad. On the next whale, I had the buckthorn. But now it is a colorful decoration. I don't think it survived. The rain must come. Pavlovnia is complaining. Look at these. And then I planted some more of the same trees lower down, but they are all gone. I'm not too sure if it was the deer or the drought, but uh, not too much success with these four types of trees. Tonight or tomorrow night is new moon and uh, it is absolutely beautiful to go outside and lie down and look up and see all the stars. Stargazing. 
Unfortunately, I don't know much about the stars. I only know the three sisters and uh, that's more or less it. Now with the rain, some clouds, obviously that will not be possible. But for the last seven months, it was very possible and we did it often. On the western side, this is the markers for the new swell to come. Just waiting for the rain. Because my excavator is small, it struggles. We have picked up all the stones. First of all, uh, excavator is not happy with stones. And then also we need them in some other places. So this whole area has now been cleared from stones, except a few boulders, which I hope to move with the excavator. And we have also removed the brush and the branches. So when the swale is ready, we just draw down into the swale. That's why they all lie with their roots facing downwards. Easy to pull into the swale. And uh, we do that because we want to keep the moisture in the swale and also for this brush to decompose and create some nutrients for the plants on the berms. So that is our way of creating better soil. The stones that we picked up came here to the lowest part of the creek. We widened the wiki leaky weir to this side and also stacked a few rocks on top. The dogs they just love eating these acorns. Veterinarian says it's okay as long as they keep defecating. So there must be in one square meter more than 50. You like it, Luna? We planted some veggies. We had them outside in uh, shade for a week from the nursery where they come from. And uh, this is cabbage. Some more cabbage and cauliflower. Lettuce, and cabbage, some cardo, some radish, beetroot. Cabbage and broccoli, carrots, onions, and then lots of coriander and other herbs. I don't know what they are. And the sand is not a new invention of gardening. We just had them these seedlings in the sand 
to keep them moist and instead of carrying wet sand I just threw them here so uh, this is the only reason why the sand is here one here old pomegranate tree with one huge fruit I hope we can harvest it they usually crack open when the first rain appears so let's see maybe it's days today tonight tomorrow when it's raining we will harvest it the quarters of the two savages sky and luna the ones that are always locked in at night the plastic is on the rain can come I've also placed a, a log of uh, the oak the cork oak because they started chewing the cork and they love it so maybe I can have some bottle tops for the wine if they process it well melon and watermelon another two fruits we promised ourselves that we will harvest it as soon as the rain comes my Vachelia Karoo I'm very proud of them the water tank is full the rune is waiting to be reconstructed it will be a beautiful apartment beautiful view till next time Goodbye.